Hey, hello everyone. So I'll show you this time how to set up developer chat under uh, Laravel framework. So first things first. Uh, so I have already set up a virtual host, which has under like PHP uh, version 7.4. And I have just updated uh, uh, Laravel uh, branch from official repository. So let's try to do these things and this is the root folder of uh, virtual host so what we do first we clone this repository <clears throat> so uh, we now have to move all the files from the helper chat laravel up front uh, one folder so that you can do whatever uh, which way you want but I just uh, move it uh, uh, everything one folder up and, and, I, I, and I override everything so okay we have this now we need uh, let's quit Miner. we need to change user again to uh, Apache one as it's the default one uh, user so we have everything as is and now we can uh, uh, we can clone official developer chat uh, uh, repository itself okay let's do this one quite big it's possible to clone it another way so only like two last uh, commits would be included also we're waiting and, uh, okay, and we are done so in the same folder now we have uh, this uh, we have a chat folder which we just cloned we can remove not needed anymore this initial form let's change owner to Apache again so everything looks fine now we can try to uh, we can also now copy these commands to create a scene links so we have scene links also, we need to copy uh, the files from uh, official repository to root folder. Okay, now we just uh, link also storage folder. Okay, so that's it. Now we can try to refresh to get auto error. Interesting why. Let's pause a video. Okay, actually, I guess I just need to install Composer yeah, independent because I have multiple versions. I do it like multiple PHP versions. I do like that. And I click this install. Okay, uh, I don't want to run it, it's super user, run user, minus, uh, command look like, uh, user, Apache, user, Apache, and I want to run it like that. And should be fine. Okay, now let's see. Okay, so as you see now everything uh, loads and I can continue normal installation now. Just so I'll pause the video until I put my 
uh, database login just so so I have put uh, database login so I just enter uh, default setting let it be admin 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 my email and support and default let's try finish let's again put admin and that's it and you have everything uh, working now if you for example uh, make some error uh, now actually you should just uh, make a copy of environment file uh, without example and have it in the same root folder and put your uh, database logins which you can do after a video but after a copy you should put just uh, these settings according to your installation and let's try for example now let's make some uh, uh, error for example and we go to help a chat modules and it will be front uh, default let's try something uh, like this mm -hmm. I just changed the folder's permissions so and now I can write to it. So I open it uh, uh, settings and uh, default settings file and just I disable cache and enable uh, double output. I save it and if I refresh you get uh, now a lot of uh, error because I have this uh, uh, syntax error. And if I restore, it restores. And if I try to create a request which does not exist, it will get to this level L. So everything is now uh, handled under uh, Laravel. And if you want to debug the app itself, you can just execute that command, which copies environment file to environment. And now if you make some same error, instead of uh, 500 error without any information and you save, you will get something like uh, that, which is uh, Laravel uh, running. So you can pretty issue easily now be sure that you are running Laravel and all its uh, uh, options. So that's it. Bye.